Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Very good. So, yes, tell me. A Tayane falou que tá tentando entrar lá. Ah, sim. É, avisa ela para mim, manda no grupo, ver se ela tem que, às vezes, atualizar o programa, que ele parece que teve uma atualização recente. E aí ele fica girando ali, girando e não entra. De repente, ah, avisa. Avisa eu... ela, por favor, do grupo. Beleza, eu aviso lá. Valeu. Só fazer o update. <risos> Okay, Carlos, how was the weekend? What did you do? I'm fine. I drew and used the computer. Nice. Very good. Very good. And you, Nathan, what did you do? Fine. And what did you do during the weekend? Ah, tá. Então, teacher, eu tive que, tive que fazer uma viagem... Aí, já fez uma semana aí. Final de semana agora, eu cheguei em casa. Vim pra casa. No domingo. Ontem. Aí eu cheguei... Cheguei já tarde, já. Aí eu já cheguei e já capotei. Fui dormir. Ok, you got home. Ok. Recently. Very nice. Ok, ok, ok. Bom, daqui a pouco começou a hora carrega. Deixa eu ver se alguém está perdido no WhatsApp, tem mais qualquer coisa, vocês dão um alô aí para mim também, porque o celular está no limbo. Bom, ok. Very good. Last class, we talked about the book eight, and I marked some pages as a homework. Let's correct the homework, people. Yes, teacher. Book eight, book eight, page eight. Ah, but eight, page eight. So in this page, I have a dialogue, dialogue, and the title is, where do you live? Hey, Tony, did you move away from your parents' house? Yes, I did. I'm living with my girlfriend now. Cool. Is it a house or an apartment? Oh, it's a small house. And where is it? Oh, it's near my job on Merlin Street. Nice. How is it like? Oh, it's all yellow. It has seven rooms, small garage, a big back, sorry, <clears throat> a big backyard. I love it. What about the neighborhood? Oh, uh, is it nice too? Yes. It's very calm and quiet and my neighbors are friendly and polite. <laughs> Well, I have to go now. Good luck in your new house. Thank you, man. Bye. People, in this conversation, did you understand all the words? Yes. Okay. Very good. So, uh, we have here some maybe new words. Okay. So, uh, in the first phrase, we have Move away from, move away from is like uh, ir para longe, okay? In this case, move away from your parents' house, parents, mother, father, okay? Very good. Uh, in the second line, we have living. This word living é morando, okay? I'm living in Jacare, for example. We don't say that. We say, I live in Jacare. Okay? This is a, a kind of informal, informal English. I'm living with my girlfriend now. Okay? Now complements the present continuous. But the best answer always in this case is to say, I live in. Okay? Uh, let me see. Near my job. Nice to see you. Like. Ah! Neighborhood. Neighborhood is where is your house? The place where your house is. For example, my house is here in Parque Santo Antonio. This is my neighborhood. Okay. People, do you like our neighborhood? Okay, teach. Do you like your neighborhood? Like. Yes, yeah, so neighborhood. What is that? I don't like. Okay, like me. Sometimes I like to 
to kill some people, but I can't. Uh, a neighborhood is the place you live, the place where your house is. Not in the street, but in all, in the group of streets. We say this district, yes? We have the center of the city. It's not center, it's downtown, yeah? We have Parque Santo Antonio, uh, Jorge Emilia, Florida. So our neighborhoods are districts, okay? For example, uh, I am a little experienced to live in Jacare. I, I live it in Secapi. Uh, I live it in Parque, California. I lived in Jardim Emilia. No Emilia, Jardim Dindinha, next to Emilia. I live in, I live it in São João. A Dindinha, so, no, no, I'm confusing, I'm confusing, sorry. Dindinha is next to São João, yes. Um, but I live it there in Jardim Emilia. What is the name? Vila, 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 Vila Ita, I think, Vila Ita. Uh, next to Senai, the old Senai. Não sei se o novo abriu ainda, mas bem. The Senai in Jacari, in Jardim Emilia. And there we have Vila Ita, if I'm not bad. Yes. I live it in... What else? Ah, é Jardim Primavera. Yes. Now I am in Parque Santo Antônio. I live in many different neighborhoods. Okay. Now in Parque Santo Antônio is good. It's a little good. Because, for example, when I used to live there in Jardim Emilia, Vila Ita, my neighbors, I suffered much there. Very bad place. Very bad neighbors. So, do you like your neighborhood? Yes or no? Tawani, yes. Tawani, no. Stephanie? Yes, no. Yeah, no, no. Stephanie? No. I, get... I don't like it. You Everyone. don't like, yeah, yes. Stephanie doesn't like. So, who else? Carlos, do you like your neighborhood? Yes, I like it. Mm. Natan, you, do you like? Yes, I like. Okay. Tawani, do you like? No. No? It's like me. Okay. Iris, hello. Do you like your neighborhood? No, no, no comprendo. No comprendo, silencio. <laughs> Bom, and you, Vanessa, do you like? <laughs> no microphone? Okay. Uh, gente, meu celular morreu, gente. Não liga mais. Caramba, gente, que doideira. So, okay. Okay, uh, the next word is about your neighbors. Neighbors are people who live in their houses, okay? Some neighbors you like, some neighbors not. Some neighbors, they like, hello, I like, okay, it is. So, some neighbors, they listen to uh, funk every time, every day, yeah? Uh, no limit. Yeah, no, ah, midnight, no problem. 2 a.m., they don't have a limit. But some neighbors are so helpful, yes? You ask some help about sugar, about fruits, about something, and they give it to you, yes? For example, have you ever had that situation in the life? Já, já pediram açúcar para o vizinho? Nunca? Não. No. Ô, vizinho, dá um quilo de açúcar aí. Põe eu devolvo. Meu acabou aqui, tá tudo fechado agora. Gente, é. eu não entendi essa F. Letra F? F? Como assim F? É. Que F? Da página 9? Não, cara, peraí, relaxei. Peguei. Agora vamos ter aula de meditation, Ok. Todo mundo inhaling, exhaling. Ok, ó, oh, people, page 8 ainda, tá? Relaxa aí. É, neighbors, então, neighbors, people who live 
in their houses, okay? In the house next to your house. So, uh, some of them I like, some of them I hate. Some, uh, some of them, né? Eles acham que eu não tenho câmera, né? Eu depois o chuchu lá fora, eles acham que eu não vi eles. É, tô de olho em uma especificamente. Vou falar para você, viu? Tá me enganando. E tem mais um que acho que mora no final da rua também, que já pegou o chuchu sem pagar. Que injustiça! Tá bom, gente, tô, tô, tô brincando, mas é verdade. Ó, voltando para aula. É, neighbors. Sometimes they are lovely neighbors, sometimes not. In this case, they are polite and friendly. Do you remember? Polite? Yes or no? no. Yes. Okay. Oh, polite uh, is a definition, is a kind of personality about a person who is, who likes to use it. Thank you. Excuse me. Good morning. These special words uh, are typical from people who are polite. Okay? Using the magical words. I think it is. Okay. So, are you all polite people? Yes. Sometimes. Yes. Sometimes. Sometimes is the best answer. Depends on the situation. Uh, depends on the person. Depends on the place. Mm, I know. So, very good. What else? And say a friend, blah blah blah. Okay. Next page, page eleven. Esquece a página nove, tá bom? Esquece, esquece a página nove, tá bom? <laughs> page ten. We have a paragraph. I live in a big house, which has three floors and one basement downstairs. We transformed the basement into a big living room. Mm. On the main floor, there is a yellow kitchen and a bathroom. On the second floor, there is only my bedroom. It's big and comfortable. And there is a staircase to the attic. In the attic, there is an office. There's one office that I use to work and one pink bedroom for the guests. I love my house. The only thing I miss is a garage. People, did you understand the words in this paragraph? Which words not? Teacher, você tem que página? Page 10. 10? 10. Ah, tá. Nine, 10. É uma página que tem no livro. O que, que é? O que, que é? Downs, down? Downstairs. Down, é, downstairs. Ok, let's check together. Vamos conferir juntos. É isso aí, tá certo? Você não pode ver. Pronto, isso isso com esta. Compartilha a tela. Compartilha a tela. So, ok. É... O que é mesmo? Downstairs. Ó, oh, staircase. Teacher, mas eu falei downstairs, não staircase. Ok, vamos, vamos por partes. Ó, oh, what is stair, staircase? Staircase are these steps you have in a house to access uh, the upper part of the house. Yeah, this is a staircase. Okay, so if you check, if you want to separate these two parts of the house, if you want to separate, we have upstairs, which is the part of the house in the top part, and we have downstairs, that is the base of the house, the level of the street, you know? Did you understand the difference? Yes. I think it is. Okay. So the part here, let me see if I can write here. <laughs> Salvar como. Para, para, para. Open, open with the paint. <laughs> okay, so uh, this part here, this, this part here, all this part here, can you see the, the red 
circle is not circle specifically. Can you see? Yes. Oh, this is the downstairs. The downstairs. One minute. Downstairs. Okay. And one there. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. And we have here this part of the house. Eita. O negócio é isso aí, levar um 3 a 0 pro computador. Cadê? Aqui, okay, achei. Agora vai. Agora vai. Ah, garoto. Ok. Mas, gente, eu tinha seta. Por que eu usei as setas? Não faço, né? Ó, oh, ah, agora vai, hein? Nossa, cara, eu fui muito cabeção. Ok? Gente, isso não é uma casa, isso é uma seta, tá bom? <risos> so, é, upstairs. Upstairs. Nossa, gente, eu estou digitando bem pra caramba, né? Bom, então temos o upstairs. Mas por que, que eu não fiz assim, ó? Nossa, lá eu sou muito cabeção. E o downstairs. Ok. Ah, agora vai. Agora, 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 agora vai. Ah, downstairs. Ok? These are two parts of the house. You can talk about downstairs or upstairs. If your house contains two different levels, ok? In this case, you can separate. Upstairs is necessary to take the stair to, 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 and go upstairs to take something, for example. Suppose your bedroom is upstairs, is, is in the top of the house. So, if you have to take something, you have to go upstairs. You go to your bedroom, you take something there. After you finalize it, and you want to have dinner, for example, suppose the kitchen is downstairs. You have to go do, 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 downstairs to have dinner. Did you understand, people? Yes. Good. Very good. Olha, top, gente. Preciso fazer um curso de informática urgente. Eu não sei fazer as coisas direito no computador. So, okay. Very nice. Uh, this is downstairs. What else, people? Teacher, basement. 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 Okay. Basement is a part below uh, the street level. Street level. Nível da rua, ok? Below this, below this, ok? We have the basement. Some houses, they have a basement. Some old houses, they have a basement. And basement is a very nice place that you can uh, do something. Typical basement, very common. But you can transform the basement in a very beautiful place. Take a look. <gasps> My goodness. Uh, é, porão? Porão. Yes. O basement dessa casa que é mais bonito que a minha casa mesmo, entendeu? É fantástico. Fala pra você, viu, cara? Uh, basement. Take a look at this. How beautiful. Oh, my goodness. One day I will have money to transform this kind of basement to, uh, or this kind of basement in this kind of basement. Ah. Uh, is there any basement in your house, people? No. 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 There isn't. No. No. Acha até estranho, Tito. What is that? Yes, the United States is very common. If you feel watch many movies from there. You see this, and it's very common and normal to have basement there. <gasps> My goodness, I want to live there. Perfect. <laughs> Wonderful. Okay. Very nice. Uh, more words, people?
Hakiki, teacher. Hakiki? É, eu acho que pode ser isso. A, a, é ethic, né? C. Ethic. Ah, é. ethic. Ok, ó, let's suppose. We have the normal level, the street level. Let me return here. Uh, cadê eu? Ah, eu aqui. É, we have the street level, the normal level of the house. And we have upstairs, upstairs, and we have downstairs. Ok? A possibility. Imagine three different levels. Street level, street level, upstairs, and downstairs. Street level, uh, the different name is main, main floor in the text, second line, main floor. Street level, main floor is the same thing, okay? Uh, here, downstairs, we have the basement, okay? And here is possible to call attic, is the top, top part Acho of the house. I think the teacher is... Yeah. Uh, so uh, so, uh, mm. so fala. Yeah, similar to the basement, but in the top part, attic. Sometimes it's very beautiful too. Take a look. Um, no, no beautiful. Uh, uh, yes, cozy. You know cozy? Cozy is a combination of comfortable and simple, okay? This is a normal attic. Very ugly, actually. Okay. But sometimes the edge are very beautiful. Take a look. Ah, wonderful, actually. And very hot because it's wood. Mm. Take a look. Mm. Bibliotheque in English? Uh, library. Library, yes. Library home. Kind of office. Take a look. The natural kind in Brazil. Yes, if you go to this part in my house, it's not my house, but uh, here where do I live? Where I live is a, similar to that. Very ugly, dark, and dirty. Sometimes they're beautiful. More words, people. Teacher, é, tem uma que é guests. Isso, essa é a minha pergunta. Ok. Guests are people. People you invite to your house, they're guests. Suppose you have a party <laughs> to celebrate your birthday, for example, and you invite people, invite your friends. These friends, these people who will come to your party, they are called guests. Ok? People to invite to a celebration. A person who is staying with you, a person that you invite for a social occasion, such as a party or meal. Ah, okay. Sometimes they're friends, sometimes uh, members of a family, sometimes colleagues, people, people you invite to... É convidar ou é convidado? No, it's not a verb. Convidar in English, invite. A person is the guest. Guest is your friend, for example. Let's go to my party. Yes. So we have one guest. Then you invite more people. Oh, let's go to my party. Let's go to your party. And you invite people, in this case, their names for the situation are guests. Okay. Take a look at this example. Is he on the guest list? You have to confirm, depends on how special is the party, how, uh, how is the organization. And you have a control in the entrance of the party. You have to confirm if the name is in the list. If the name is not, bye, you can't enter. So in this case, is he on the guest list? Okay. Okay. Perfect. So let's go to the questions. <laughs> Page 11, page 11. -da 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 -da. How big scale is a house? In this case, you have to identify the size of this, okay? If it is, it, if it is small, small, uh, small, medium house, or big housing. 
How big is it, people? Big house. I'm sorry. Yes. Each is a big house is the first phrase. How many floors are there? Floors are places uh, in the house. When you separate the housing parts, their names are. Uh, uh, no, no. Falei besteira, esquece, apaga, corta, edita, tira. Oh, <laughs> how many floors are there? Floors, uh, like floor. You are in your where you are in your house, and you drop your cell phone on the floor. <laughs> <laughs> this is the uh, so three floors. Yes, the levels, the floors. Uh, three floors. Mm, okay, it's possible. Except the basement. It's, it's totally possible to to count to three. Okay, but if you include the basement, four. Okay, according to the picture. Tolhe na figura, tá gente? Uh, okay, in this case, there are three or four, depends your point of view. Uh, three squares, no, three or four floors. Nossa, isso é trava língua. Three or four floors. Caramba, vamos ver que eu consigo falar isso rápido. Three or four floors. Three or four floors. Three or four floors. <laughs> Casa suja chama suja. É, Casa suja chama suja. É. Trava línguas aqui hoje. É. Tongue twister. É. Twister, twister tongue. We have this on the internet. The twister tongue, ok? Twist tongue. Nossa, gente, tô péssimo. Bom, quando que eu ditei certo no. Vai passar a vida inteira, né? Vai acabar a quarentena e eu vou ainda continuar falando. Que eu digito errado e ruim. Twisted. É, Tom Twisters. Better people pick a pick a... Não sei fazer isso, não. Better bottle bought some butter, but she said the butter is bitter. É, if you put in the, ba the butter, it will make better bitter. But a bit... <risos> Gente, depois vocês treinam. Eu vou jogar lá no, no grupo pra vocês treinar um pouquinho. Trava línguas em inglês. Nossa. Can you can? Can you can? Nossa. Can you can as I can? Can or can? Can I can? Nossa. I saw, I saw a kid eating chicken. The, nossa. I saw a kid eating chicken in the kitchen. Uh, consegui. É, bicho. So, volta pra aula, mano. É, returning to the class, letter C. What's there on the main floor? A, a yellow kitchen and a bathroom. Yes, there is a yellow kitchen. Yellow and a bathroom, yes. A bath. All soap, all soap, a bath room. Eat the queen, the queen. Bath. Bathroom. Não tem letra, gente. Estou usando letra. É, what color is her liver on? Yellow. Is it yellow? Where? Is the confirmation. No, but it is. É, the second floor, there is only my bedroom. It's a big and comfortable. There is a third case of that. There's no color. Ah, what color is her living room? I, I, I read bedroom. Living room. That chick, no sei o que, parará, banana. Huh? 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 Teacher, I don't know. I think it, but if I can. Não é yellow? In the paragraph, it doesn't have this information. <coughs> so crazy, huh? Can you see this in the in the paragraph? Because oh, no, the, 
Yeah, so at the end of the first line, it starts. So we transform the basement in a big living room. So the I see yellow. Red, yeah. maybe. Color. What color? Red. It's a kind of, take a look at the basement. Take a look in the picture. Which color is that, is that for you? Which color? Red, pink, the basement. This is the living room. Ah. Uh, Let's pose blue, man. No, it's oh, é outra coisa. No, it's yeah. the living room. Living room, no better. Ah, tá. Three. No, teacher. Three. So let's suppose it's red. Yeah, a kind of. Bom, no meu livro parece vermelho. Mas como eu não estou enxergando muito bem por esses dias, né? Então, tudo pode ser. So, então tá. É, what color is her living room? Her living room. Yes. Red. Or pink. Or guava. Ah, é verdade. Tem um de goiaba. So, next. Uh, how many bedrooms are there? How many is necessary number? How many bedrooms in the total? Two. Yeah. Three. Why? Why three? Three is. Aqui tá falando three is only my bedroom. My. Yes, yeah, so, but uh, on the second floor, there is only my bedroom. This is the part? No. Because, uh, count with me. We have one that is her bedroom in the second floor. The second bedroom is in the attic that you have the office and a pink bedroom. This is the second. This is a kind of guest bedroom. Is there a third? Tem um terceiro? No, I think not. Acho que é só dois, mas... Okay. So in this case, there there are yes. bedrooms. Next, where does he? Sorry, where does Kelly work? Obviously, she works at her all. É próprio, né? Her all office. Obviously, in the attic, it contains the guest room, which is pink. You can confirm the picture. Is it, yeah, it is really pink. And beside this, she said about the office. Uh -huh, she works there, I suppose. Next. Uh, does she like her house? Mm, she loves... Yes, she loves. Yes. It. If you want to include, uh, if you want to include the exception, you can say accepts by. Accepts uh, by the garage, which is absent. By no garage. Okay. Okay. Problems. No. Okay, let's talk about more parts in the house. We can create now a kind of list. Actually, actually, I have a list on the internet. Uh -huh. uh, in the presence of class, I... Que YouTube, gente? Eu tô tão acostumado a abrir uma aba e abrir YouTube. Que eu escuto música. Vocês podem ver que em cima tá aberto. Ó. Tem a da Pink, tem da Furby, Shirdy, Ariana Grande... Bom, ó, volta para aula. Come back to the class, teacher. Ó, é... Qual que é o nome do drive do Hotmail, gente? É... Esqueci, gente. 
Não, cara, vai. Vamos lá, entra aí. Nossa, sério? Vamos lá. Quer ver essa? Não, cara, eu não quero. <risos> Gente do céu, eu só quero entrar no Hotmail, vou dizer. Não é nem no Hotmail que eu quero, eu quero entrar lá no... No Google Drive, não é Google Drive, gente, esqueci. O Drive chama Google Drive, mas o outro chama o quê? É... Aqui, ó, OneDrive, é isso que eu queria. Vamos lá, então. Uh, and the OneDrive, I have a kind of file which contains all words related to places in a house. Ah, places in a house. Let's check together. We have here... Regular verbs, body parts. Tipo, eu ia baixar antes, tá? Mas eu cheguei em cima da hora. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. House parts. Venham comigo. Ó, oh, according to the list, de acordo com essa lista aqui, ó, oh, we have words. <risos> Ele não deixa dar azul. Tá bom, então a gente vai lá e baixa. Cadê? Baixar. According to this list, contains attic, which is that top part, ok? The second item is the barbecue room. Do you know barbecue room? Ah, barbecue room, barbecue room. Do you understand what barbecue room is? Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. teacher. Yes, teacher. Perfect. Barbecue room is a special place in the house if you are a person who is rich. You have a kind of barbecue room. Let's check some barbecue rooms on the internet. Uh, this is a typical in Brazil, yeah? But uh, ooh, this is one I was talking about. Take a look at this. Uh, it's not real, it's a computer. But imagine it to have a place like that in your house. <sighs> Would be a dream. Do you have a barbecue room in your house? Is there any barbecue room in your house? Yes. Yes. Very good. Take a look at this. Barbecue room. <laughs> it's a computer. I don't look on, I'm not looking for a computer one. Okay, that's a special place for that. The next basement, okay. Bathroom, bathroom is the place you feel like prince, a princess, yeah? Because it contains the throne. <laughs> the throne. Do you feel like that when you sit on? No. Yeah. Okay. So, like you call it. Next, uh, corridor. Corridor, come on, it's similar to Portuguese. So, dance floor. Like it. Dance floor. Imagine a place like that. No, no, no. Imagine a place like that in your house. Or like that. Take a look at this floor. When I have money, much money, I will buy a floor like that. This is wonderful, comfortable. What is that? No, it's a it's normal house. Transforming into a kind of... Ah, this is perfect. Imagine a place like that, your house, to celebrate your parties. Woo! <laughs> so, next, we have the dining room. Ah, it's typical in Brazil. It's possible. Uh, most of them are in apartments, I think. Not sure. Dining. People, claro que vocês estão repetindo em casa, né? É muito óbvio que vocês estão repetindo em casa as pronúncias, né? Dining room. Take a look at this. This is a dining room which contains a table and six cadeiras in English. Sabido, hein? Eu vou lhe chorar um pouquinho. Já volto. Cadeira in English, gente. Chair. Chair. Yes. Oof. So we have the table. We have the chairs. We have a kind of rack or. Yeah, it's kind of a rack, I think. 
It's, they're ours. So very nice. Dining room. Is there any dining room in your house? Specific place for that? Yes. Very comfortable, the chairs. Okay, the next, the next word. <laughs> we have entrance. So, entrance is the part of the house, is in front of the house, and you can receive the people. So, actually, before I receive the people, yes, where is the door to access the house? Okay, similar to Portuguese, actually. Entrance. Yes, it, con it contains about the apartments, the stores. Is that part you are about to enter in the place? Okay. Oh, very beautiful in trains. So, oh, I like it too. Next word we have there family room. People, family room is similar to the living room, it's the same. Okay. Uh, sometimes the family room, you can take off the television, the, no television. The people prefer because the family room is the place to stay with the family, no with a, a kind of uh, electronic devices. Or uh, you have two options, either you stay with the electronic devices or your family. So the family room is specific to, to stay with your family, having a conversation, okay? First floor. It's about the level of the house, okay? And nível da rua é street level or main floor. Nível da rua, street level or main floor. Acima nós temos o first floor, abaixo o basement. Acima do first vai ter o second floor, que nem apartamento, gente. First floor, second floor, third floor. Eu só não entendo por que que conta é, primeiro andar, sendo que você já anda no térreo. Você entendeu? Aí esse cara fala assim, ah, vou subir para o primeiro andar, mas espera aí. Você não andou lá embaixo também? Você entendeu? Eu nunca entendi esse negócio. Por que, que você começa a contar primeiro a partir da, do, do próximo andar? Mas não era para ser o segundo andar? Você entendeu? Ou só eu penso assim, só eu sou meio louco? Bom, você é louco eu sou mesmo, né? Mas não faz sentido, gente. Por que, que é primeiro andar? Se eu já estou andando no térreo. Não tem sentido. Bom, é game room. Oh, game room. Game room. Uh -huh. Special place in the house. And you can have gamers. Ah, take a look at this. Kiddy, uh -huh. ain't it? Yes, it's a dream. Take a look at this. <gasps> My goodness. Mini video games. What else? Take a look at this. How beautiful. Do, 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 do. Oh, my goodness. Very, very, very beautiful. It's amazing. Cara, isso não é uma cadeira, é uma plataforma de lançamento. Mano. Look. So, okay, this is the game room. So, the next is. Uh, garden, which contains flowers and plants. Do you have garden? Is there any garden in your house? Woohoo! Love is in there. Everywhere, look around. Talk to me, people. Is there a garden? No. No garden? No garden? No. You're beautiful. No. In my house, there is one simple garden. Yes, yeah, very, very simple. Contains some plants, some spices. spices. I have one too. You have one? Okay. Yeah. What do you plant? Ele é bem, ele é bem what, what do you plant? Oi? What do you plant? What do you cut a cultivate? No, sorry, I should really come up with this from Cultivate. Yes, cultivate. What do you cultivate there? No, there's hortelã. I know there's hortelã, alecrim. Some of these names I know in English. Hortelã é mint. 
might não sei, acho que eu procurei might ah, teacher pequeno aqui em casa também tem é might? é might, isso mesmo might, you have small too? hum, good é, alecrim em inglês é rosemary rosemary I love it it's delicious I can't have this in my house because every time I plant it, it dies. Very sad. Duro um mês só. Tipo isso. Olha lá. How to grow rosemary. É, só se for na sua casa, quando a minha não cresce. Ó. Oh. <risos> é. Você vai seguir essas coisas de YouTube e fala assim, ah, como cuidar bem do seu jardim? Tipo, só dá certo pro jardim da pessoa, né, Maré? Porque é um negócio de louco. <risos> Não, já tem umas dicas que parece assim. Ó, oh, é... Very good. O... Oh, tá... 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 É o Stephanie. Tá, tá o Anne. Tá o Anne. You have a small one in your house, too? Foi a voz dela que disse yes? Ah, yes. só pequeno aqui tem. Ah. Mas é pequeno também. What do you have there? O que que tem? Yes. Tem 40 pés de alface. Ah, pequeno. Dois de couve. Pequeno. Seis de cebolinha. Hum. Tem uma palmeira. Tem Nossa. salsinha. Nossa. E aquelas plantinhas suculentas. Ah, yes, I know. Ok. Very simple. Ok. Alface em inglês. Ixi. Nossa, gente, esse é simples, hein? Lettuce. Ah, lettuce. Couve. Couve em inglês. Couve é? Colored. Nossa, quase esqueci. Colored. Por um momento eu esqueci, hein? Deu um branco. É, instantâneo não é temporário. Colored. Palmeira? Eu não sei palmeira em inglês. Palme? Palm tree? Não, palm tree é palmita. É. Palm tree. É palm heart, na verdade, que é uma palmita. Palm heart. É. Coração da palmeira. Olha, tá pensando quem é, meu filho. Palm heart. Do you like palm heart? It's delicious. Mm, a long time I haven't eaten that. It's very expensive. No. No? Ok. Cebolinha. Cebolinha em inglês. Bom, outro dia a gente fala disso, tá, gente? A gente vai falar de aulas de vegetais, tá? Foca na aula. Engraçado, né? Eu me distraio e eu fico dando bronca para voltar, né? Ó, oh, é... Greenhouse. Ah, greenhouse is a special place. You can plant things, but there is a protection. Ah, greenhouse. Very nice. Inclusive, tem um termo chamado greenhouse effect. Com certeza vocês estudaram ou estudam isso em geografia, né? É, efeitos do greenhouse. Tá pensando o que, meu filho? So, greenhouse. What else? Ground floor. Ground floor. So, é um level da rua, né? É uma outra forma de falar. Na verdade, ground... É. É. Eita, gente, tem um vizinho gritando. Ó, oh, guest room. Guest room é de convidados, né? A gente já falou deles. Hall. Hall. Cadê hall? Hall, 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 hall. In the house is a little difficult to, to have, but... Oh, my God. So, if you are very rich, you can have a kind of hall like that. So... How is a kind of corridor, similar corridor, but larger, mais largo, larger, in this case is the hall, like in the shopping mall, when you enter the shopping mall, vocês lembram o que é shopping center? <laughs> Não pode mais o shopping center, já, já abriu para a de São José, né? Sei lá, ouvi falar que abriu, ou estava abrindo. Bom, é, when you enter the shopping mall, and they have that themes, aqueles temas, yes, about the Easter, about the Christmas, sometimes about uh, exposition, 
Okay, in this case, uh, they use the hall, that part of the shopping, the hall. Okay, all the parts that the people walk are called hall. Okay, it's large corridor. What else? Kitchen, uh -huh. kitchen, come on, it's the place you prepare the food. Do you like the kitchen of your house? Oh, beautiful, I like you white and black. Mm -hmm. Wonderful. Do you like people, the kitchen? Mm. I like. Interesting. Black and white, let's check. Black and white, black and white kitchen. <laughs> so, uh, I love these combinations, black and white. Take a look. It's simple and it's wonderful. Take a look at the wall. Mm. My God, it's, it's amazing. So, going back, laundry. Laundry room is the place you wash the clothes. Laundry. Então, praticando a pronúncia, né? Laundry room. Laundry room. Is that, is that place you wash the clothes, for example? Okay. So, what else? Living room is similar to the family room. Uh, maid's room is like that person who works in the house. You know? Housekeeper? Housekeeper? No? Housekeeper. Housekeeper is that girl, which girl or boy? Why not boy? That she works in the house. Sometimes this person lives in the house. Where? So the place is maid's room. Okay. Some cases the this person uh, doesn't leave the house. Não deixa a casa. Yes. It, this person sleeps there, lives there. Where? A special place in the house is maid's room. Office. Office is the place you can work in the house. Okay. Actually, now I have a kind of small office because my computer became a kind of that. And a part of my room. So, what else? Playground. <laughs> Playground. Playground. <laughs> Isn't carpet? Carpet. So, so in this case, I have the playground. Is the place that the kids can enjoy their time for many hours. So, what else? Porch. Isso aqui dá para vocês zoar com um colega, né? Fala assim, I have a porch in my house. <laughs> I have a porch in my house. Porch is this place. It's a kind of entrance of the house. Okay? This part here. Okay? Não sei se vocês veem a seta do mouse. Essa parte aqui, ó. Tá pintado de cinza aqui, ó. Okay. Ah. It's very typical in the United States. The place you can sit there contains chairs. You can see the movement, the people going, the people coming. Okay, this is a part. So, if in your house, you have this space, you can say, I have a porch in my house. <laughs> no? Take a sign. Is there a porch in your house, people? Yes. Good. Oh, very nice to relax. Just one student. My God, this nobody has except. <laughs> okay, next item of this list is the the, the restaurant. Ah, before restaurant, similar. Deliver the the bedroom. Yes, rest it means uh, to take a nap. What is take a nap? Take a nap. Isso, você faz isso na aula às vezes, né? Take a nap. Hora do, hora do nap. Take a nap. 
Let's take a nap. 30 minutes, one hour. Ok? Então, ó, these people are taking rest. Ok? Rest room is a special place to rest. Similar bedroom. Similar bedroom. Ok? Very similar. Restroom. But, não, gente, espera aí. Oh, tem como cortar? Edita aí, mano. Pode editar? Ô, oh, câmera, corta aí. O oh, diretor, chama lá. Tipo, ó, é, eu cometi uma falha, tá? Estou envergonhado agora, nesse momento, porque eu viajei, tá bom? Deve ser o, o colírio que eu pinguei no meu olho, tá? Ele afetou meu cérebro, acho que ele entrou lá dentro e afetou meu cérebro. A gente, esquece o que eu falei do restroom, tá? Eu fiquei com vergonha agora. Mas o que eu expliquei tá certo, tá? Take a nap, rest, ok? Mas o restroom, você não vai poder fazer esse, esse take a nap lá, não, né? Restroom... <risos> Eu achei até estranho, teacher. Bom, mano, você tem que dar um toque nessa hora. Falo, teacher, mas não será que é outra coisa? Como que vocês deixam passar uma vergonha dessa, mano? Tá gravando ainda, mano. Sacanagem, viu, mano? Vocês viram? Nossa, cara. Ó, oh, restroom, gente. Esquece o lugar pra dormir, tá? É isso aí, ó. É isso aí mesmo. É, restroom. Mas também, né? Quem nunca, né? Tá lá, mexe no celular, sentadinho. De repente... Não, gente, claro que não, né? Então, ó, restroom is similar bathroom. What's the difference? Qual que é a diferença? O bathroom is typical from the house, ok? Restroom is a kind of place that you can see in the shopping mall, in the store, ok? Teacher, mas se eu estiver numa loja, eu posso falar assim, moço, onde é que está o bathroom? Claro que em inglês, né? Where's the bathroom, please? Claro que ele vai entender, né? É, mesma coisa na escola, teacher, can I go to the restroom, or can I go to the bathroom, or can I go to the toilet? Eu vou entender, né? Só que, é, typically, restroom is for stores, for public places. Bathroom is typical from the house, ok? Esquece o negócio de tirar soneca, tá, gente? Que vergonha, hein? Que droga, Ó, oh, volta lá. É... Eu estava taking a nap, entendeu? I was taking a nap. <laughs> Ruth. Uh, do you remember the attic? Yes, teacher, remember. So, this top part here is the roof. This top part, which protects the house against the rain. Okay? In this case, it is the outside part. It's better. Uh, let me see, Rufus. Yeah, this protection of the house. Basically, in Brazil, it is red. Yes, but sometimes it's gray. Sometimes it's... the people can paint that. Different colors. Yes, this is a very typical Brazilian roof. Okay, or this. Which color is that? Dark red, white, brown. So, next, rooftop. <laughs> So, if you have, a, if you have uh, much money, if you have much money, you can have opportunity to pay a hotel and this part of the hotel. <laughs> Take a look at this place. And the rooftop. The view from there is... Amazing. Take a look at this. Imagine how much is the house or the room in a kind of hotel. My goodness. Very, very, very beautiful. Okay. So, did you understand? Rooftop? Ah, take a look. Is it coming, gente? Coming. Can you take a look at the Puxa vida, hein, gente? Vocês estão ouvindo eu, gente? Vocês estão aí ainda? Oh, meu Deus do céu. Yes, teacher. Yes. Ok. These are rooftop models. Wonderful, beautiful places. Ok. Uh, the next item is uh, sport court. Sport court. Nossa, tem muito por baixo. Sport court. 
Se tiver que se confundir rest não sei, mano. Ele é gênero, Ó, sport court, ok? It's the place you can practice sport in the house. Depends how big is your house. Or sometimes you live in an apartment and the apartment contains this special part. Okay. Next is the vegetable garden. Ah, uh, do you remember the garden? Yes, teacher. No, teacher. Yes. So, garden is the general name, but you can separate. You can separate garden for flowers and vegetable garden for plants that you can eat. Okay. For example, lettuce. Okay. Oh, like that. Like Taiwan. Like Taiwan is house. Okay. Oh, deve ser a foto dela aqui, ó. Deve ter 40 aqui, ó. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Ok. Very good. You can specify. This is the vegetable garden. Vegetable garden. What else? Visitor room. Visitor room is like a guest room. Similar guest room. When you have uh, people who visit you. In this case, uh, if it's very late and this person... Don't you? This person doesn't want to go back home. This person can stay. Uh, it's possible to sleep in the. the... Tô confundindo de novo, né? Espera aí, ó. Deixa eu arrumar. Uh, the person can sleep in the guest room. Sleep in the guest room, and you can receive people. Receive, not sleep. Sorry. Uh, you can receive people in your house in this specific room. It's similar a living room. Let's check on the internet. Let's check together. Visitor room. Visitor room. A special place you can say hello, hi. You can have a conversation with your friends. Oh, sometimes the Google shows guest room. Uh -huh. I was not too crazy. Ah, again, visitor room. Ah, again. Eh, the both, the both, the both. Either for sleep or to talk, to have a conversation. Uh, what else? Any yards? Yards. In Brazil, we don't have green. Because Brazilian people, they don't like grass. I don't know. I don't know what happens here in Brazil. But we don't like grass, or we don't have this habit. Our culture is not about that, okay? But is that part of the house? That's not the garage. Is the yard because it contains uh, no grain, no grass. But is the free area uh, the kids can play, or you can distribute some chairs to have a conversation, or you can do whatever you want there. Can prepare a party, so. And sometimes I have the backyard because this part is not is not in the in the entrance next to entrance is in the back of the house backyard okay so I mean some people they have backyards problem civil no no teacher okay I suppose I will download this and send in the group this long list okay. And what else? Mm, the time is over. Uh, you can go through next pages, page 12. Page 13 is necessary to listen to the audio. And class two is about, class two is about. Ah, we have here some other names, page 17. No, not necessary. Okay, two pages, 12 and 13. 12 and 13. Okay, this will be our homework. Where is the word? The word is here. É 15 mais 7, dá? 
15, 16, 17, 18, 22. Isso, 22. 20 seconds. Homework, book 8, page 12 and 13. Okay. And next class, uh, we're going to talk about furniture. What is furniture, people? Are objects inside the house, table, sofa, and many different other objects, okay? The, their names are furniture, okay? Okay, teach. People, thanks to, to have this opportunity to have the class a little later, because I had to go to the doctor and the doctor was at two, the appointment. So supportive, thanks a lot to be comprehensive. And people, don't forget to access Plataforma Microcamp. Don't forget to access the Facebook videos. And now the self time. <laughs> Who's gonna open the camera to take a selfie with me? Ooh. Are the self <laughs> É... Eu vou lá descansar no restroom, hein? Se demorar muito. <risos> descansar no restroom. Ah, oh, I like your glasses. Os new glasses, Stephanie. Hum, good. Hi. Tá, a sua xará. Tá, 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 tá. Tá bom, isso. Né? Só pra me confundir, né? Olha, vocês, vocês armaram isso pra mim. Não é possível. Who else? Quem mais? Bia, Bia voltou e saiu. Ah, a Bia, ela voltou só para ir dar uma selfie, né? É, não, eu vou dizer, não sei, tá, tô brincando. E aí, vamos para selfie? Nada? Deixa eu ver, então tá, vai. Three, two, cadê o print? Ah, one, go. Ih, eu acho que alguém tava mexendo o cabelo nessa hora. Oh, meu Deus do céu. Pera aí, ó, paint. Deixa eu ver aqui, pera aí. Peguei o piscou. É, ela saiu meio de cabelinho de lado, né? Deixa eu tirar a outra, vai. Three, Two, não fisca. One, go. Vamos ver, agora foi. Agora, a, a, a... Meu olho tá ardendo, gente, acredita? Peguei um colírio ali. Yes! Agora foi. People, oh, thanks a lot. Have a wonderful rest of the week. Bye-bye. See you next class, people. Bye, teacher. Bye. Bye, teacher. Bye.